Robert Benson is a 60-year-old African-American man that has just been diagnosed with stage 2 prostate cancer with a Gleason score of 7. He lives in Hyde Park, Chicago, and is married. He has three sons and several grandchildren. Stage 2 prostate cancer with a Gleason score of 7 means that it's more advanced than stage 1 but has not spread out of the prostate. The survival rate with treatment is about 100%. Gleason score of 7 means that um, it is histologically a mid-grade cancer. Um, DNA mismatch repair gene mutation or tumor suppressor mutation is a potential condition called Lynch syndrome where you have mutated in the DNA mismatch repair genes um, increased risk of colorectal cancer and prostate cancer. Transportation for Robert is most likely not an issue since it's close to a high part. Some questions about his social support are, is his spouse and sons close by? Can they assist in his care? What is his functional status? Does he have any community resources like a church, club, etc.? He was concerned if it's genetic since his ha dad had it and if it was passed down to him. There's two best options for Robert radiation therapy or radical prostatectomy. Radiation therapy is external beam radiation. The type of radiation therapy for Robert is branchy therapy, which is rods inserted into the prostate, and it's a local treatment. The con of this is that it increases likelihood of, of GI and bladder cancer. So it can cause urinary incontinence and impotence. The pro of it is that it can, the cure rate is 95.5%. Radical prostatectomy is surgery to remove all the prostate gland and some tissues around it. There is a possibility of it causing fecal continence, urinary continence, or impotence. There is also active surveillance, which is when your lifespan is shorter than 10 years and you'll be watched. Um, for current research in prostate cancer, uh, we'd like to know more about genetic sequencing for DNA mismatch repair mutations or other genetic abnormalities that could cause hereditary cancer, which is especially important in Robert's case. However, treatment is fairly well established at this stage. Um, to understand the role of health disparities in Robert's case, we'd like to know what his income is and how he supports his family. Uh, we're, we want to know about if he has any concerns about taking time off work um, and would that influence his decision to seek treatment, especially because this cancer is very curable. We'd also like to know if he has healthy food access and the ability to pay for prescriptions, which would impact his treatment. Created using Powtoon.